Hi, my name is Alex Kendall, CEO of WAVE. I wanted to show you some of our latest demo videos driving autonomously here in central London. This is a far cry from what you might usually see when you look at autonomous driving demos, which are typically filmed on highways or in simpler environments like you might see in Arizona in the United States. Here you're going to see a self-driving car drive through one of the busiest areas of central London. And this is something we do day in, day out to support our testing and development. You will see on the left the video that our algorithm sees from our roof mounted cameras and on the right one of our expert safety drivers. Our safety drivers uh, hands are hovering near the wheel for safety but all control of the vehicle is, is done by our driving intelligence itself. It's under full autonomous control. Here you're going to see it drive through a really unstructured environment. Um, there's loads of vehicles around us, it's really unclear where lanes are and check this out. This double-decker bus is going to pull out in front of us, but we need to make a left turn. Our system is intelligent enough to slow down, let it come out, before making a lane change and tucking in on the left here. Now, this manoeuvre is something that probably you or I would even find hard. It's a really tight squeeze, and our car is driving just with monocular cameras. So no LiDAR, radar or other range sensors, but it's able to really dexterously move through there. If we fast forward a bit, soon the light is going to go green and we'll pull away and, and complete the left turn manoeuvre. For me, that's one of the most complex examples of autonomous driving or autonomy I've seen in my career. It's a really exciting and, and compelling demonstration in one of the toughest driving environments. Here we're going to see our car do an unprotected right turn. This is regarded as one of the hardest manoeuvres in autonomous driving because we have to cross a line of oncoming traffic. So you'll see our car pull out into this is also quite unstructured scenario, it's chaotic, there's things going on everywhere. We pause, let these vehicles pass before making this unprotected right turn. Now hey, if that wasn't enough, we're going to show it again, this time later in the day, because it's really important to look at robustness when it comes down to autonomous driving. And this is us doing the exact same scenario and showing that we can do it again with reliability. Again, it's, it's, uh, there's a lot going on. There's cyclists, there's pedestrians, there's things everywhere. And as we pull into this intersection, you're going to see that it becomes even more cluttered. This, this motorcyclist, I don't know what they're doing, but they pull in, they block the traffic, uh, and our car knows intelligently to, to wait, and wait before the, uh, the, the path is clear before safely completing that unprotected right turn manoeuvre.